subscribe and watch the come alive. And make sure you hit the notification bell to get notified every time I upload. Thank you. Pizza, pizza. Pizza, pizza? Yeah. First, and, and Sunday's video was cheese, now it's pizza. Hmm. I'm hungry. Of course you are, Clem. <laughs> and today's Creative Sim, in case you haven't seen my furnished collab with Kirkland Sims, this is the family that's that's going to be, that's, that's supposed to be living in the Glimmerbrook Cottage that I, the one that I furnished in Kirkland Sims, of course, built. Yeah, Farmer Jim and Penelope. No, it's not them. Oh, I'm sorry. It's, here we have Sylvia's Bishop, and then we have his wife, Gazelle. Ooh. Yes. You say his name was Sylvia? Sylvius. Oh, I can already say. <laughs> I swear. <laughs> <laughs> I swear, Clem is ridiculous sometimes. I am. Um. Okay. Sylvius is asking for. Sylvia. What? Maybe his mom's name Sylvia. I don't know. Like I said, I haven't memorized all of the aspir new aspirations yet, but I think the aspiration is spellcaster sorcery or sorceress, something like that. And the trait for Sylvia says bookworm, loner, and genius. Of course, they're both spellcasters. Giselle's aspiration is the what the heck is that one? The al purveyor power, alchemy, oh. Pur purveyor potions. Yeah, purveyor potions. Yes, that's what it is. And of course, I'm, oh my god, I'll, I'll say what her traits are whenever she pops up because I, I think her, one of her traits are loves the outdoors, she's good, and, oh my god, I don't, I don't remember the third trait, but I'll, I'll get to that part, I'll, I'll say what her last trait is whenever we get to her. <laughs> I'm sure Clemmy, Clemmy, Clemmy has a story for them, so take it away, Clem. Um, Sylvia and... Sylvius! Oh yeah. I swear, I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna kill Oh, him. I know, I know. Sylvie ass. Yeah, that's what it is. No! I'm just kidding. I'm gonna kill you. Go ahead, though. And Gazelle, which is like. Sleek. Animal. What? Very transformed. I'm sorry, I got lost in thought. Her last trait's perfectionist. Uh, okay. yeah. Go ahead, Clem. Anyway, they met at a. At uh, David Cook, the magician, he was, he was doing his magic at a, at a, at a sleazy bar, and they both went there for a few laughs because they really could do ma magic, and of course he was fake. They were sitting on opposite ends of the bar watching this guy make a fool of himself, and they were both laughing their asses off, and then he calls up Gazelle because she's a very lovely lady to go to disappear into the cabinet, which he called a cabinet, which I don't know why he did, but he just did. Anyway, when she got inside the cabinet, she, she snuck out the back door and then left outside. So the guy could never make her reappear, and it made him look like an ass. Everybody <laughs> in the bar was fucking cracking up. Oh my god. When she walked back in, Sylvia laid eyes on her, and it was like instant kiss, but they, they just, they got along so great. They duel, and they do all kinds of crazy shit, but they're a really great couple. Oh! Are you done, Clem? Well, uh, yeah. Okay. I didn't know for sure, Clem, because you didn't say anything. Sylvia, my ass. It's Sylvia's. Sylvia ass. Yes, I know. Oh, my God. <coughs> Excuse me. So, after my favorite outfit on, I'm going to kill you, Sylvius either has to be his everyday or his cold weather. For Gazelle, I would have to say her everyday and party, I believe. I have, I love creating them. I think they're, I think they're a perfect couple. Well, yeah, they're a cute couple, perfect couple. And I think they're, I think they're, Perfect for the home, in my opinion, anyway. Yeah. I, oh my god, I can't, I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Ugh. I don't know, I think, I think they'll probably have kids, kids someday. Uh, yeah, they both want kids. 
Yeah, see, Clem knows all. I do. I'm clairvoyant Clem. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so those are. I think those are party. Or I don't remember. What the heck? I think I'm gonna get you a damn memory boost. <laughs> Here's the thing. Allergies are a thing. So that's why. Pump it up! Pump it up! Pump it up! Oh, oh, oh. I don't know what to say anymore about Clem. Clem is just ridiculous at this point. I am. No way, those no way, those are every day in hot weather. Now I remember. Oh. Okay, I'm getting mixed up a lot today. I don't actually every day. That's normal, but still. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what what, the, what they would name their future kids though. I think it was something cute. Anyway, I think we're getting close to the end of the video. Thanks for watching. I hope you found this heartwarming and probably funny because of Clem. Kick. Jump to the jump in here. Kick. Jump to the jump in here. I love you all so much. Bye. Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye, everybody. And play to hell. Uh, <laughs> Goodbye, it's it. And a lion. I wasn't the one to use this Kevin Arnold. Thanks for telling me, Fred. You're welcome. Goodbye. Goodbye.